How's it going? It's Henry. So in this video, what I want to talk about is how to stop being confused when it comes to dropshipping and when it comes to Facebook ads. And as a matter of fact, when it comes to any marketing at all, how to stop yourself being confused. So I get a lot of messages. I have been getting quite a few messages from people saying, Henry, I'm so confused when it comes to dropshipping. Do I need to stock this product? Do I need to stock that product? What works best, a general store or a niche store? Henry, um, should I... Uh, how do I duplicate this ad, Henry, uh, with a question about manual bidding or whatever the case may be. A lot of people that are confused about the next step when it comes to drop shipping or when it comes to your Facebook ad. So what I would say, the short answer on how to stop any confusion when it comes to your drop shipping um, e-commerce store, when it comes to your Facebook ads, your email list, whatever it may be with marketing, how do you stop the confusion that comes about? The one short answer is basically implement and take action. So implement and take action what do i mean by that so basically whenever you are implementing something new there's going to be an element of confusion you're never going to know 100 percent how to have a successful drop shipping store if you've not had it already so for example i'll give you the example when i started a drop shipping store myself so i first found out about drop shipping i discovered some content about drop shipping myself and then i thought this seemed like a good idea but I was confused about certain things. So what did I do? I just implemented quickly the stuff that I, I did know. I didn't know I had to find a, a niche. So I, I quickly found that niche and then I started a store. Whether or not it was going to be the most successful store or not, I did not know, but I implemented that quickly. So from the time that I found out about dropshipping myself and the time that I, I start implementing and set up a store was about two weeks that is even a long time but i implemented as quickly as as i could in that instance with this youtube channel for example i decided back in january that i wanted to start putting our content on the youtube channel but i was confused as to how to grow a youtube channel should i upload a video on thursday should i upload a video on sunday what tags do i need to do what is the precise content i'm going to be talking about i did not know fully and in fact i still don't fully know my 100% direction with this content but what I did know is I had to implement quickly so I started putting out videos without having the perfection with the videos with my email list that is now in a couple of weeks about 500 people I didn't know exactly what sort of content I was going to put on there but I did know I had to start an email list I wanted to start an email list so I implemented without having that without waiting for that perfection so to speak so the point of this video is with your ads with any Facebook concept I'm talking about in this video, you aren't going to completely get rid of the confusion, especially not without implementing. So if you are hearing any piece of content from me or from other people about dropshipping, about e-commerce, about anything like that, what I would recommend you do is quickly, as soon as possible from the time that you consume the content, try and implement what you hear in the content. So when you watch a video from me talking about PPE ads or website conversion ads or whatever the case may be, I would recommend you to quickly to validate that idea in your mind, validate if what I'm saying is actually true, implement that as quickly as possible, set up a page post engagement ad for yourself, set up a website conversion ad for yourself, and then see which works better. So put that these concepts that I'm, I'm saying to you or these concepts that other people are saying to you, put them in practice as soon as possible and you're going to reduce the confusion that you have from watching videos like this. So again, the point of this video is when you consume any content, implement it as quickly as possible in order to validate it, in order to remove that confusion that you have. Again, whether it's a page post engagement ad, whether it's a view content ad, whether it's a manual bidding strategy, implement that as quickly as possible. And I still do that as well, by, by the way, because even though I've reached a certain level with my success with Facebook ads, I'm still learning as I go along. So when I hear a concept, another Facebook ad concept that somebody has used as working well for them, I try and implement that as quickly as possible to see if that works for me as well. So the point of this video is basically, as I said, implement quickly when it comes to Facebook ads, whether it comes to dropshipping, and any marketing at all and in fact with business in general so once again i hope you understood the point of this video i hope you got value from this content subscribe if you want to see more of this content on a daily basis and regardless once again thanks for watching the video and i will see you on the next video